Hi, this is Jaron at the Newport England Marine. I'm here with Dave. He's done a charter boat stuff for a long time, and he's going to show us some simple uh, coho fishing setups with the uh, Pescaro Triple Threat. This Pescaro, when you drop it out behind the boat, it just kind of planes along the surface until you stop letting your line out, and it dives. When a fish hits it, it spins over, comes to the surface, and you're, it's just you and the fish. Uh, the thing throws great magic when you're going through the water, sits there and dodges back and forth like that, making this lure swim back and forth. It is adjustable. You can play with the depth as well as the action. Uh, using the Pescaro Triple Threat Diver Dodger combination, it's great. Uh, don't have to use a conventional deep six type diver and a flasher. This is all one. Nice thing is you can just click it straight to your line. I always like to put a golf tee above my line so gear doesn't get wound into the tip of the rod for those people that uh, get really excited. Um, also using the Salmon Magic UV lures. They work great. You can fit them on either way. And run a couple of beads below it to your hooks. Run that on either skirted like that or conventional, which makes it just kind of hang. I like them flared out like that. They work really good. Arms length. This one's actually a little bit short, but uh, 30 inches or so on these leaders works great. Um, going from the Salmon Magic, we go to my favorite, which are Hoochies. This particular one, got a little skirt underneath the little pink hoochie thread it down like that arms length just like that with the snap on there do remember guys you are fishing in the ocean make sure to crimp your barbs um, next up on that one my personal favorite hook setup instead of a double hook setup is I like to use a number six or six aught siwash hook which is an open um, open eye I crimp that down with a swivel on it then I put what we call a gum pucky underneath the hoochie something like that right there slide that down tie your swivel on there again or your snap and you're ready to go and after you've gone from hoochies if you want to go to cut bait or uh, spoons lengthen your leaders out from 30 to 40, 45 inches of spoons. Uh, I'd recommend about 50 inches along with the, if you like twirling whole herring. Okay guys, just to recap, using the triple threat Pescaro uh, diver board, you got your salmon magic, you've got a hoochie, which you can use, I recommend on anything other than a spoon using a little bit of chunk herring uh, or a scent. So you've got your salmon magic, you've got a hoochie or spoons. A variety of different sizes and styles. They all work really good, especially this year. <laughs> the coho are crazy. Um, like I said, these you want to run at least a 48 inch liter. And the hoochies you can run a 30 inch. Um, I guess that's it. Tight lines, my friends. Till next time. <laughs>